Welcome to Crop Monitoring Guide. Let's talk about field analytics. You can see the curve of current and historical indices data from year 2016. The historical data helps us to understand the tendency of the how plant grows on the field so it would be great if you have a chance to check it for your field. The Sentinel-2 satellite allows us to provide images every five days at the Ecuador and every two to three days at the middle latitudes. The image quality fits agricultural purposes perfectly. It gives 10 meters of landscape per pixel and with such a resolution you can get accurate indices data. What about the cloudiness? We show all images less than 50% clouded and provide cloud masks for less. In terms of soil moisture, views provide soil moisture content in the surface at a 5 cm and root zone up to 70. Root zone is calculated from one of the direct soil moisture products. The penetration depth is from 5 to 7 cm and historical data starting from 2015. Precipitation. You can see the historical precipitation and forecast for 14 days with our weather app. Forecast precipitation could be really helpful for farmers for watering planning, so you can save some money knowing that soon it will be the rain. Temperatures that we also provide information about, about the heat stress and the cold stress. Forecasting can help you to predict harmful weather conditions and save your crops. Field analytics are valuable for different people. For an insurance, for instance, if the client say that he got crop loses and instead of the plant 10 tons, he collected five, then the insurer can check the history of the crop development, stages of growth and level of vegetation. If the client signed a contract for planting one crop and then planted another, can happen arson on the field, especially among competitors. You can estimate the scale of loses and measurement the burnt areas. Field analytics are also valuable for the farmers. It helps to monitor critical changes in the vegetation. The tool remotely identifies problem areas, thus significantly saving time and money. It helps to monitor weather risks. Weather and precipitation forecast for prioritizing processes within field work and planning tasks. It helps to control how agronomists work on the current field and set them tasks for checking weak zones. You will need fewer agronomists to inspect many times more area. It will save money on staff. If NDVI shows that everything is fine, then the inspection of the field can be done by agronomists less often or even on request.